Hi coders, welcome to a new video. In this video, we're checking out a new AI tool from Google. It is called Stitch. It can design app interfaces just from text prompts. You simply type what kind of app you want, and Stitch automatically creates the UI for you. Sounds interesting, right? I've already opened Stitch on my screen, stitch.withgoogle.com. Here, there are two options, mobile and web, so you can create designs for both. I'm choosing mobile for this demo. There are also two modes available, experimental mode and standard mode. The experimental mode uses Gemini 2.5 Pro, while the standard mode runs on Gemini 2.5 Flash. If you choose the standard mode, you can also download the design directly to Figma. But I'm going with the experimental mode since it's more powerful and can generate better results. Here we can see some suggested prompts that you can use to get started. But I'm going to create my own app design. So, I'll open Google Gemini and ask for some ideas for my app screens and theme patterns. This is the prompt for my app. I'm going to create an AI-powered GIF suggestion app. You can choose the canvas option and just click Submit. Gemini will then generate clean design ideas for us. It provides the screen names, their details, and also suggests theme colors for the app. Once it's generated, just copy the full content. Then paste it into Stitch and hit Submit. So, Stitch analyzes the prompt and gives some page suggestions. We got some of the pages like Sign and Sign Up, Onboarding Page, Dashboard Page, and Gift Suggestion Page. Now just click the Make Them All button. Stitch is going to create the designs for us. After a few seconds, Stitch generated this really clean and nice looking app design for our application. And honestly, I really like how it turned out. It looks modern, smooth, and way better than I expected from just a simple prompt. And it also generated images that match our app content, which makes the design look more realistic and professional. This page is for finding new GIFs. Here, you can select the details needed to generate a GIFT like selecting the relationship. This is the GIF generated page, where we have a list of suggested GIFs based on the details we selected. Now you can see that Stitch suggests some next step pages to continue building the app flow. I'll use this suggestion to create one more screen and see how Stitch handles the new design. It generated the GIF summary screen, which shows the selected GIF details in a clean and organized layout. I think we need to improve the UI and UX of this gift form screen to make it more user-friendly and visually appealing. Here, we have a download option. Just click download and then open the folder where the design files are saved. This is the screenshot of that page. It also provides an HTML file and it's working perfectly. That's awesome. I'll copy the screenshot and open Google Gemini again to get some improvement ideas for this screen. I'll ask Gemini for some UI and UX improvement ideas, and I'll provide the screenshot of the page for better suggestions. It gave some improvement ideas, so I'll copy those and paste them into Stitch to update the design. Now, let's compare both UIs and see how much the design has improved after applying the suggestions. It added some useful descriptions, included relevant icons, and improve the alignment of the selection options, making the overall layout look much cleaner and easier to use. The best thing is that it removed the next button. Now, when you select an option, it automatically moves to the next question. This makes the flow faster and saves the user's time. So, I'll delete the old screen and use this new, improved version for my app instead. Another great thing is that we can create multiple variants of the same screen, which helps us compare different layouts and pick the best one for our app. See, it generated the same screen but with multiple variants. Each version has some modifications. The first one has the GIFs aligned in rows, the second one includes a calendar option, and the third one adds some filter options. 
It even provided a dark theme variant, which looks really nice. So, I'll choose the option that looks best for my app. And finally, we have an option to change the theme for our screen. Just select any color, and it automatically updates the entire design instantly. This is our final app design output, and it looks really clean, modern, and well-structured. Stitch did an impressive job turning simple prompts into a complete, polished app design. That's all for this video. If you found it useful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more coding and AI tool videos. See you in the next one.